According to the media in South Africa, they want to declare Chidima murder wanted for fraud, for document fraud. And again, a lot of South Africans are not happy that Chidima's mother was able to attend Chidima's uh, inauguration as the Miss Nigeria. Because that's her mother there, and also I think that's her father as well. But apparently, it's her mom, it's her mom that committed the fraud, so they want her arrested and prosecuted. Meanwhile, they are also asking the South Africa government to withdraw Chidima's uh, passport to make her excommunicado. That is how they call it on uh, John Wick um, uh, um, movie. Chidima should be excommunicado to remove her as a South Africa person forever for life. Ah, South Africa, she is quite wicked though. Now don't forget, say, this, this girl did nothing wrong. She does not suffer for an offense she did not commit. Yes, I do feel like I was Nigerian. And I've always felt Nigerian from the moment that, that I was born. It's not just because of the opportunity that was presented to me. And I think people who have known me will see that I've always embodied that spirit of being a pure, proudly Nigerian woman. So um, I don't want people to feel like um, she only feels Nigerian just because, you know, she was offered an opportunity. I've always been proudly Nigerian and I'll still be proudly Nigerian as well. We sure hope you... One of the reasons why they decided to target her was because she was so proud of being in Nigeria. Let us not forget about that. See, no matter how we Nigerians are feeling about it, let us not always forget that one of the reasons why this girl was rejected was because she proudly flaunt Nigeria. Before you say, oh, Chidima doesn't deserve it. As a Nigerian, before you talk about remember. Why was this reason, why was this girl targeted? Because she proudly flaunt Nigeria. She hung out with Nigeria, apparently her first marriage in Nigeria. Come on, man. Her name doesn't sound South Africa, Chidima, Adesanya, Adesanya, something like that. Her name doesn't sound South Africa. Uh, I never knew you guys were, were, were now checking name. That means if I name my, if uh, people that are called uh, Priscilla, Precious, David, uh, um, Daniel in South Africa, that is to say their name doesn't sound more like South Africa now. The best thing for you to drive them to European country now. <laughs> wow, Allah did this life. Oh. Eh? <laughs> South Africans, eh? ah, now wow. You made her cry and uh, you humiliated her and now they are coming for her mother. If you come for her mother, good and fine, she committed a the crime, then ask how she committed the crime and so on. But she demands South Africa by bet. She demands South Africa 20 something years in South Africa. Never traveled out to Nigeria. 20 something years in South Africa, you just gonna just push her out just like that. Just like that. Come on, man. Are you guys that heartless? Or is she among those who are committing crimes in South Africa? Has she been caught committing any form of crime before? Is she among those who are doing drugs in South Africa? It's her name among... So, if someone in a family is doing something wrong, so the whole family should pay. The whole family should pay for the same sin. So I tell the man to pay, okay, you are saying Nigerians, Nigerians are doing this. So should the innocent Nigeria pay? Should Chidima pay? Well, leave our Chidima alone and allow her wherever she chooses to stay, whether she chooses to remain in Nigeria or go back to South Africa, left for her, guys. Left for her. Left for her, guys. Don't push her away. Uh -uh. Don't push her away. You made her cry twice. And in a recent interview, she also cried as well. 
Stop being so. Man, people are so heartless or something, somehow, somehow. Well, check out the story of this girl who left her husband to start a relationship with another woman. Her name is Minia Baby. She said, I spent two years of my life unhappy with this man. I've been in denial about my desire for women and I'm ready to live in my truth. I was never attracted to this man. I never fell in love with this man. My husband was just a good guy that I felt I needed, but I never wanted him. I don't give a F what everyone thinks about me. I am choosing me and my happiness. I am much prettier when I smile, and the smile is something this man never gave me. I, f I, file, I feel the divorce. What did man do you? Eh? You see now, she's trying to leave this man to pursue, to pursue her heart desire and trying to make it look like this man was a bad guy. You were interested in women, that's why you never in any way Someone, someone never respected this man in, the, in your own marriage that made this man doing some certain things that, she, not, that he doesn't really want to, wanted to do because you, were, you, you had a cross heart. And now you want to leave, you are making it look like this man was the devil. Meanwhile, you were the devil. You already exposed yourself by saying you never loved him. That means the man was right. If you guys ever had issue, the man has been right a long time ago that you never really appreciated him. Now you are making him look like you are, you are blaming yourself and indirectly not blaming yourself and also blaming the man as well. And indirectly not blaming the man. She also continued, she said, I've been with my husband for two years and I never smiled. You go moaning. <laughs> <laughs> you deal with your husband for two years, you never smile. The only Oboni, how did they tell you no smile for your life? <laughs> if they give you money. <laughs> the day I, I seen you at the truck stop in Mobile Philly Station, that 18 uh, wheeler hop, I instantly fell butterflies. Baby, in one month, you gave me a feeling that a man couldn't give me in two years. I am tired of hiding my true self. I want you to know I am ready. I'm ready to walk away from my marriage and spend my life with you. I love you, woman. Wahala deo. Women can really, really be ungrateful. A woman will dump you one bit to follow their heart desires. She said, look, I said, I don't give a half what everyone thinks about me. I am choosing me and my happiness. If he was a man who decided to be like, you know what? I'm leaving this marriage. I'm choosing me and my happiness. They will say the man is not man enough. But if, was a, if now it's the woman, they will say, oh, the woman is actually choosing herself and happiness because she has went through a lot in her marriage. People never... Think for one that we we'll never think for one that men also go through a lot. Choosing you, 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 you. Good and fine, but making it look like that man was a horrible person. People never think that men also go through a lot. She's choosing herself and her happiness. Doesn't give a damn about what anyone thinks. And many people are going to make excuse for that woman, make it look like, oh, that woman was, was, was uh, having a really bad marriage and all those things, but they don't even think about the man. I think one of the things eh, we should start asking whenever we want to get married, hmm? plus all those questions, numerous questions we have been asking, whenever I want to settle down, we ask each other some certain questions. I think you guys should include it in your own memo. Are you interested, if it's a woman, you ask the woman, are you interested in other women? 
and woman, you should ask the man, are you in any way interested in other men? Ask so. Let that person you put her own mouth, his own, his, his or her own mouth to tell you that, no, I am straight. Yeah, that is one, because the world is turning to something else. How straight, are you gay in any way? Or are you a lesbian in any way? Or do, do you like to do both in any way? Because nowadays, not just safeguard yourself not to marry someone out of their own will. And later on, they'll be putting the blame on you and making you look like the bad person who never wanted them to follow their dreams of being with the right partner. Yeah. That is how crazy the world is now. Well, that's what's the boy get Adam's link. I should then start. Peace.